Hi, I'm Lindsay, and I'm going to be finding out what these guys know about tabletop cricket. So, what do you know? You don't know. Well, well, it's aimed at basically people with disabilities, physical disabilities, cerebral palsy, people with severe learning difficulties, so they can all actually have a go at a particular sport. What do you find the kids like about the sport? Well, they can all have a go, regardless of their abilities. Uh, they can all take part and have a go and enjoy themselves working as a team game. I met Diego, a new and enthusiastic tabletop cricketer. I'm quite enjoying it. It's quite a good game. First, in bowling, you need to hit it really hard. So then they don't have a, um, time to get tactics to hit it. And then you also need to uh, get the bat and also hit it hard so they don't have reflection time to move their men. Hi, I'm Le France and I've been playing tabletop cricket. Um, you have to move these type of slide things and make sure the ball hits the white or the red and not the green. So if it is the green, that means you've not done your job properly? Um, it means that they get um, um, a point. Value stuff in I've been playing table cricket. What do you like about it? Um, I get to hit the ball and roll the ball. What do you prefer? Um, this, type, this type of tabletop cricket or regular cricket? This type of cricket. We've found somebody who doesn't think tabletop cricket's just for year sixes. Martin, aren't you a bit big to be playing this? Uh, no. Well, yeah, I am actually. But I'm addicted. I saw the year six kids playing it. They enjoyed it. And I need some batting practice as well, to be honest. This sport is perfect for learning new skills in teamwork as well as having a good time. The English cricket team could learn a lot from these guys. Oh, and remember, it's not just for kids. This is Lindsay Verity Book, reporting for SMC News from the Academy.